collocation is a, a pair of words or phrases that are often used together and they sound they sound correct to people who are native speakers but you cannot guess the meaning from the words themselves that's why collocation is quite difficult you need to remember which word goes with another word but there are some ways to categorize uh, collocations into different types so as to make it easier for you to remember each pair and this PowerPoint is about synonyms synonyms means words with similar meanings and uh, now let's look at this table a and b words have similar meanings but in collocations one word is possible and the other one is not let's look at this example close and shut means the same however we can only use close the meeting if the meeting ends we cannot use shut the meeting and other gatherings that can be paired with close are meetings discussions and conferences conference means large very large meeting and how about shut that if you ask somebody to shut their mouth it's very rude and um when you see the the dentist they only uh, when you say dentist he or she may only ask you to close your mouth uh, because you are uh, the dentist client and the second pair is start and begin so it was a cold morning and i could not start my car but start is to pair with is to be paired with engines and vehicles however when you when we uh describe something that is abstract that means you cannot see that means something you cannot see in your daily life then we use begin or began universe means uh, the stars you see in the sky and uh, these planets and stars are distant from you so and then the any concepts about the universe uh, is quite abstract it's not easy to imagine another pair is large and big we can say a big decision big problems these um less concrete than real life objects and then here i want a sweater in large size size is more concrete it's easy to see and next pair consists of end and finish that we can say uh, a film finished relationship fin ended uh yeah we can say the film ended but we cannot say but when we refer to homework we say finished homework okay next and there and then here i will talk about synonyms words with similar meanings okay old I, I i guess every of you knows the meaning of old there are and there are many ways to express the concept of old for example she studied 
ancient history about the past. How about furniture? We can use antique, means that this piece of furniture was made a long time ago, maybe a hundred years ago. And then she collects antique jewelry. Maybe this, drew, uh, this jewelry uh, was discovered more than a hundred years ago. And then I help an elderly person. Uh, of course, we can say an old person, but elderly is more polite than old. And when we refer to the situation in which there's nobody with you, we can use single, okay? Single parent or lonely. And if you uh, describe the, situ the situation of feeling very, very, very lonely, you can use the effort desperately, desperately. And uh, there are some verbs that can be paired with alone. For example, live alone, traveling alone. And if we want to describe a lonely figure, we can use solitary. Solitary. Figure means person. Also, we can use the soul. Soul means the only person. And she was the sole survivor of the crash, maybe plane crash, and everyone else died except her. And I'm an, an only child. That means that child, unfortunately, has no brother or sister. And this is a unique occasion. That means, occasion means time, moment. And this is a very rare occasion. You may not be able to go through or experience the same occasion once more in your lifetime. And there are some more synonym pairs. For example, I need to charge my phone. You can charge batteries and any elect electrical items. However, you cannot say charge the lorry. You can say loaded here. They loaded the lorry and drove away. And it can be used for cargoes means goods, products, okay? If you put some cargoes onto lorries, vans, ships, then you can use load. And then three injured people were taken to hospital after the accident. So injured. Injured can collocate with people. And the shop tried to sell me a damaged sofa. Sofa is an object, so we use damaged. And then how about charge? Uh, oh, sorry, how about this is, should be grow and raise. Grow and raise. Plants, crops. Appears with grow. But for animals and humans, we use race. That means they are becoming bigger and bigger. 